In this video, I'm going to show you Onscale Solve, our latest cloud SaaS product that integrates with Onshape. Let's start out in the customer portal where customers can manage spend, they can allocate core hours to projects, they can also manage their projects, they can manage their simulations, they can see which simulations are currently running or have completed, and they can manage their teams. They can add team members and add core hours to teams. Now I'm going to walk you through a simple parametric CAD on shape to on scale integration. We're going to start off with on shape. I've designed a I beam here that has holes that can be configured. The diameter of the holes is a parameter. In on scale, everything is a parameter, including parametric CAD. So it's very easy for me to import a on shape CAD model and actually bring in all of the configurations that I've set up as parameters. You can see those configurations here. Once I've imported the Onshape CAD and all the configurations, I can now begin to set up the on-scale simulation parameters, things like material properties, or boundary conditions, loads, fixtures, etc. Again, all of this can be parameterized inside of the on-scale solve environment. Now that I have a fully constrained simulation model, I can execute these simulations in parallel on the cloud. In this case, we're gonna execute five simulations in parallel, representing the five CAD configurations that I created in Onshape. Note that I only had to set up my simulation once and the simulation parameters are automatically applied to every CAD configuration. This is done through our powerful Sim API scripting language, which you see here. Next, I will automatically generate a mesh or meshes. I can select my favorite mesh. I can estimate the simulation time and cost. Cost is expressed in core hours, which is a cloud compute unit. And then I can execute these simulations each in their own Docker container on the cloud in parallel. Now in the interest of time, I've sped this up just a little bit, but this executes pretty quickly especially compared with simulations running in serial on a desktop using SOLIDWORKS simulation. So now I've got my simulation results. I've got the results for each of those CAD models, all five simulation results, and I can easily slice and dice the data and generate the reports that my boss wants to see in order to find an optimum design. I can do all of this without downloading any data or files, and I can archive this in the cloud. Next, I'm going to show you an example of Sim API, our powerful Python-based scripting language that makes us enterprise grade and separates us from competitors like SimScale. First, I'm going to set up a simple parametric simulation study. In this case, I'm going to apply two loads to this motorcycle swing arm. Each load will vary between five different force levels, yielding 25 separate simulations. I will auto mesh and I will use OnScale's AI estimator to estimate the simulation cost and runtime for this study. The runtime will be the same because we're executing all of these simulations in parallel. However, the cost in terms of core hours will go up because we're running 25 simulations. Again, we'll run 25 simulations each in their own Docker container. I've sped this up a little bit, but this is much faster than running 25 simulations in serial on a desktop computer. I can review all of the results of each of those 25 simulations in the cloud. I can slice and dice the data, look at deformation, for example. I can, of course, look at individual sim results for each of those 25 simulations, but I can also compare the simulation results. So I can drop a pin and then I can plot the results of each of those 25 simulations at that point. More importantly, we have a Jupyter Notebook backend that gives the engineer access to the entire 25 simulation data set. So you can see the data uh, each in its own individual folder on the left, and I can use Python scripts to post-process that data. I've got access to everything. If there's not a feature in OnScale already to make the visualization or plot that you need, you can very easily create your own visualization, create your own Python graphs and plots just as you would in MATLAB on a desktop, except all of this can be done in the cloud in a web browser. 
Next, I'll tell you about the applications that OnScale is targeting as we add physics and features to our product. The first is modal and frequency analysis. This is a must have for a lot of structural dynamics. We're also working on advanced LBM CFD that will be available very soon. This is very useful for things like microfluidics, internal flows, external flows, etc. Uh, in this example, we're looking at a microfluidics application that will power next generation of labs on a chip. And here you can see the transient CFD results from that simulation. We also have a complete thermal analysis package for things like thermal analysis of PCBs, where you can set up common thermal loads. And you can look at the heat distribution in a PCB, for example. We're also gonna be announcing very soon that we've coupled this with our LBM CFD capability for things like conjugate heat transfer, uh, for electronics cooling and other applications. That concludes this demo. Thank you for watching.